Hey guys, and welcome back to sharemyhunt.com. This week we're going to review something a little bit different, something that you probably wouldn't expect to see reviewed on a hunting channel, but it is something that I'm going to use on a hunt, so I thought it was relevant to you guys. Um, for you mountain hunters out there, I'm booked to go to Alaska, to Kodiak Island on a Rocky Mountain goat hunt, but I also hunt chamois and tar. Um, I've got some hunts booked for Barbary sheep in South Africa, for Valerie buck in South Africa. Um, these are all backpack hunts where I'm going to be carrying everything on my back. Weight is at a premium. Now in Alaska in particular, as well as the southern island of New Zealand, it rains a hell of a lot as well, so staying dry is super important. So you're going to need to carry a towel, but you're also having to carry all of the gear on your back for multiple days at a time, need to be extremely weight conscious. So, I went down to Kathmandu and I noticed this in my passing, they have little travel towels there that are 20% nylon and 80% polyester. So you want to go with, with a synthetic because synthetics dry a hell of a lot more than natural fibres. So you definitely want to go with a synthetic option. The other reason why you want to go with a synthetic option is that it is light, 165 grams for the extra large towel and the towel is 75 by 150 centimetres long. So it's actually pretty close to a normal towel size at 165 grams. The other thing, apart from going into its own little cool little carry pack here that I could put in my bag and never lose it, and it's quite obvious what it is, um, it also dries extremely quickly. Now I tested this the other night, had my shower, jumped out, used it to dry, worked. Okay, it's not as pleasant as a normal cotton towel that you would have in your bathroom, but it did get me dry and like properly dry. And then I hung it up and came back 30 minutes later to see if it was still wet. It was dry. So polyester is the way to go if it dries you and it did dry you. Now here's the downside, 70 bucks. 70 Australian dollars for a towel is a hell of a lot of money, but you can get around with it. About three or four times a year, Kathmandu does do a sale, and they normally discount these sorts of things down to half price. So I got mine for $35. All I needed to do was sign up for a membership, which was free um, when I was actually in the store, and I got my discount. So guys, if you're looking at doing backpack hunting, climbing mountains, multiple days with a lot of weight on your back and you're weight conscious and you're looking for a towel or something like that that can keep you dry then the Kathmandu polyester lightweight extra large towel is probably the way to go.